Hello guys, this is Feeding Frenzy 91 and I want and um as the title says, it's a good day for Wii U or a good time at least. Basically just wanted to bring you guys some gaming news that the Wii U in the UK jumped up by 685% after the release of the, of the Wind Waker bundle for Wii U. Now, one thing I want to say about this like who didn't see something like this coming? I mean, the, the the people were just waiting for the Wind Waker bundle to come out. I mean, it just made sense. It didn't make... Because everybody knew the Wii U was going to have to do a price drop. We knew that had to happen before PS4 and Xbox came out. If it didn't happen, that wouldn't make no sense whatsoever. And it did happen, and it happened earlier than I expected. I expected it to happen around, like, um October this month. But it actually happened last month, September 20th. Kind of messed up, because I bought my Wii U. I literally bought my Wii U, I think... A week before it this this was announced if that had happened I would have probably waited until after this announcement so I could buy my Wii U when I for the Wind Waker bundle because I really would have liked Wind Waker HD but since I already played Wind Waker on the GameCube it's not worth me buying it again at least personally not to me it is I mean I mean if, if, if it came with the system I would have, I would I played it over of course because Wind Waker was a great Zelda game honestly it was but since it didn't uh, come with my particular system, then I'm not gonna probably probably not gonna buy it again. But uh, just it just goes to show all you need is really whenever you, whenever whenever Nintendo is struggling, all they really need is a price drop. Work with the 3DS, working now with the Wii U. Of course, it's still a little bit too early to say whether this is like gonna is this a permanent thing, like whether the 2.99 price, which is which is which is a hundred dollars less than what the PS4 is going to be will actually allow the system to be a great competitor for them or whether they're going to still need a lot more than that. I, I think they probably do. They still need some a lot more like exclusives out right now. They need to appeal a lot more to the third parties. And other than that, um, I think um, I just think this is great news for Wii U. All Wii U owners can be happy also because I think that um, there'll be new friends on Wii U online. You know, maybe it'll be more popular now. Maybe um, They don't have any figures, so we don't know whether this is how much UK was selling initially. See, you can check for the world. I know that the world sales went up by by almost double because on on VG charts at least on VG charts they said like that during the week of September 21st to September 28th, I think it was, they like 43,000 some Wii U's were sold, and I knew it was only like 29 initially, so it almost doubled for. Wii U sales wor worldwide during that uh, during that week. If you just use VG charts, of course VG charts isn't completely accurate, but still, this is great news for Wii U, and I hope that the sales continue rise, and I hope that we also find out what happened in the U.S. Hope that th maybe the U.S. even sold more. I don't know. We won't know yet because they only have it what happened in the U.K. Though, of course, the U.K. seems to be um pretty big on Wii U's whenever. Something like this happens. Don't I don't I don't know why. Cause I I remember back when Xbox One announced that they a lot of their features weren't going to be coming to the UK. That a lot of people bought Wii U's. Like it jumped up by 875 percent, which wasn't actually as much as people initially thought, because like Wii U's weren't selling that well exactly. And plus, it just jumped up on Amazon, according to this our article at least. Wii U's period, have jumped up by 685%. Not just Amazon, not just GameStop, not just any random store. We use at, we use period, which means that um, the sales of the system itself have jumped up by 685%. So that's a lot more than last time, even though last time it said 875, because that was just Amazon UK. But, so this is a lot, a, a much bigger jump. Anyway, uh, that's all I had to say. That um, it's good news for Nintendo. It's good news for Wii U owners, and hopefully it continues. And hopefully the rest of the world follows suit. I don't know whether it will because they haven't gotten the figures yet. And hopefully this figures is a lot bigger than what may and may be. Because really, if you think about it, a 685% jump that could simply be from like let's say that people in the UK were only buying a thousand Wii U's. If people were only buying a thousand Wii U's before, 685% jump. Is only about 68,500. <laughs> so with that, even though that is a big jump, it's still not um, like a massive one. It's not like if there was 
30,000 we use being sold before and then now there's like over 100,000 being sold weekly. So anyway, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. God bless.